हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक सो इन टूडेज डिस्कशन वट वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग इफ एज अ फ्रेशर यू वॉन्ट टू ज्वाइन अ क्लिनिकल रिसर्च फील्ड एंड यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू डू एनी कोर्स और यू ऑलरेडी सींग देर आर अपॉर्चुनिटी एंड यू वॉन्ट टू गो हैड एंड अप्लाई वट यू शुड बी नोइंग टू एंटर एन अ क्लिनिकल रिसर्च विदाउट डूइंग एनी कोर्स सो यू कैन बिल्ड दिस नॉलेज बाय सेल्फ सेल्फ रीडिंग बिकॉज देर इज अ प्लेंटी ऑफ मटीरियल अवेलेबल ओवर द इंटरनेट the first thing you should be knowing is that uh, clinical or a drug development process basically under the drug development process you should be knowing okay how drug journey start from the lab and it comes to a market like what is preclinical what is phase 1 phase 2 or phase 3 trials and what is ind or nda application the question comes from where you can learn this honestly this is easiest uh, to learn and there is a plenty of information available over the internet you can download any published article i can also link one or two in the description but you can download by yourself by typing drug development process or you can go to the regulatory website like uh, fda they have described in a such a good way what the overall drug development process so these are way to learn this now coming to second part what you should be knowing international regulations which is only one as of now is ich so under ich ich is very broad term they have a guideline for safety efficacy multidisciplinary they have a lot to cover right but you as a fresher should be knowing only one guideline that is ich gcp e6 now how you will learn you can go to i c website hit efficacy under efficacy there is e6 guideline and i think i can also cover this in one of my you know um, sessions so how you can download e6 guideline and you can download and you can read it all 13 principle of gcp they are there now coming to third part which you should know is the regulation what is the regulatory body in your country so like in india we have um dcgi and uh, if the trial is happening in us then it is fda and europe and so on so um, you should be knowing what are the international regulatory bodies right and plus what is the regulatory role in our country which is dcj and you should also be knowing the new drug rules 2019 now again from where you can learn new drug rules 2019 simply type on a google right or go to dcj website you will be able to download the whole booklet and it's very easy as a fresher you need to cover a couple of topic like icf i am um, you know process of icf and the ec registration and uh, uh, you know so that you can find in these guideline so as a fresher even if you are going for an interview you can focus on drug development process right plus uh, understanding of icgcp third knowledge of regulatory bodies and this you should also mention on your cv so that your cv get screened right thank you so much i hope this is very helpful thanks for watching turn on the notifications and do subscribe rise and shine channel for getting such valuable contents